Hello again, everyone. In this technical analysis of the stock market video, I'm going to take a look at the Dow Industrials on a daily and weekly basis, and actually on a monthly basis also. We're going to take a look at the last couple of weeks here of trading. There was really holiday shortened trading that had a tremendous amount of volatility and gave us some of the worst, so you know, including the worst month since 1931 and the worst Christmas Eve ever. So let's dive in and take a look at this. Here's the Dow Industrials. Here's the daily chart. This is my Elliott Wave preferred count that I've got on here. And right now, uh, we're working our way down in a uh, minor wave three. And so far, the market, you know, we've had a lot of volatility, but the market has not invalidated this wave count uh, at all. Uh, when I talk about, you know, the worst, uh, the, some of these worst, worst type of readings, this was December 4th right here. December 24th, sorry, December 24th, Christmas Eve. This was the worst Christmas Eve that was ever recorded in, in U.S. stock market history. And the reason is, is that, you know, December is, is typically been somewhat of a, you know, bullish bias to it. And it hasn't really had a lot of strong selling. And, uh, and again, the holiday type of uh, bias on uh, Christmas Eve, etc., well, then we got that huge day the day after Christmas on Boxing Day, December 26th. Huge move to the upside. Got a little bit of follow through the next day. And then here we are, you know, the, here's the, uh, uh, the volatility kicked in with the Apple news on Thursday. And, you know, then we bounce back on Friday. So the net out from Thursday and Friday on the Dow Industrials, we are up a whopping 88 points since the close on Wednesday. OK, and again, we had a holiday shortened week in here. Let's take a look at the weekly chart. So here's the weekly chart and here's the view that I've got in terms of the first five waves down. That's all I'm projecting at this point. Uh, you know, we are again, we've had back to back weeks to the upside in here, very much like we had back over here at the end of October into the first week of November uh, in here. Uh, and it was basically the beginning of wave two that became uh, a flat, a wave two, Elliott wave flat. And then we started this wave three down. I don't believe that wave three is complete yet. Uh, and the daily waves are continuing to confirm that. And that's what we're constantly monitoring on a daily basis, looking to see, you know, where are we? What is the market telling us now? Is everything confirming this scenario or is something else going on? So, you know, we talked about the worst, and I talked about the worst December since 1931. Let's take a look at that. So I'm going to pull up in a different software package, a monthly chart of the Dow Industrial. So it's a little different view, a little different software package. But here's the month of December right here. And you can see we closed the month of December. This little bar right here is just showing you the price action in the month of January so far. And of course, January is not complete at this point. Uh, and so we closed December below the trading, the even the lowest readings of trading of the last 13 months. OK, so pretty negative move. And this was the the. Uh, the worst sell-off for the month of December since 1931. So where is 1931? Well, you got to go all the way back in here into the depths of the depression and look at, you know, back into this price action right in here, 1931. Uh, this is my preferred Elliott wave count that I've got, the long-term picture. This is the trend that's going on. And, you know, I believe that we are in the, the labeling I've got here that's in parentheses is the Super Cycle Wave 3. Super Cycle Wave 4 ended in 1932, and I believe we are in Super Cycle Wave 5 that is, is, has ended in, 19, in 2018, and uh, this is Cycle Wave 5. So Cycle Wave 1, 2, 3, 4, and 5. And this has been a fairly extended cycle wave in here for Wave 5. Uh, but that's the picture. Let me go ahead and zoom in a little bit so we can see where are we. Now, I, I believe that we are coming down. I've looked at the wave count in here, and I've got the wave count I've talked about many times. And back in January um, of 2018, I think it was the February 3rd uh, video I put out on February 3rd. If you go back into the YouTube videos here on the channel, I said something has changed. 
Something has definitely changed and, and has gone on. The volatility exploded in the month of January, at the end of January, into February. And that has continued to happen here into the end of January uh, of 2018 and into 2019. And I, I don't think it's going to slow down anytime soon. Now, watching to see this channel with the dotted lines. This is the whole bull move since uh, March of 2009. And I think the breakdown will really be confirmed when we break down out of that channel, which we haven't broken down yet. Now, it has happened on the S&P 500. They've broken below that trend line in here, connecting these major lows of you know 2011 and uh, 2016. And the S&P 500 has broken down. The Dow just hasn't done it yet. So that's the current picture. Here's where we're at. And here's where we're at on the weekly chart. Uh, with the Dow, and here's the expectation. So that's it for this week. Everyone have a wonderful week. We'll be back with you next week. And if you felt like this uh, video was helpful, hit the thumbs up. And if you're not a subscriber, subscribe. And if you'd like to get uh, more information, you have a couple of choices. Uh, first of all, you can head over to the website, joehenches.net. Actually, let me take you back right here, joehenches.net. It's beyond the chart. And you can uh, subscribe to the free uh, video updates that I produce. Uh, first name and email, and you're good to go. They come out uh, twice a week. Or if you want even more information, get uh, trade ideas, get uh, technical analysis of all the markets uh, on a daily basis, uh, then join the membership. And you just go up here and click, click to the membership up here and check that out. All right, that's it for this weekend. Everyone have a wonderful weekend. We will talk to you on the next video.